What's going on everybody? Stanley Parrish here. Pistol Outflow Studios and welcome back to the show where I uplift you through art, graphic design, photography, and videography. Well today's episode is all about how to arch your eyebrows using Adobe Photoshop. So to all my ladies out there, if you had a photo shoot and you didn't get your eyebrows arched before, don't worry, it can be done all right here in Photoshop. So let's get right into it, shall we? So I'm hanging out with my girl Salon, you know me and her, we're good friends. No, but really, I tried to find some pictures of other um, like celebrities and stuff like that, but everybody had their eyebrows, eyebrows arched already. It was like, I couldn't find anything. So I found this one, so I said, I'm gonna just go with it. Uh, I'm gonna be using my Wacom tablet. I told you guys before, get your Wacom tablet. Um, it makes editing like go so much faster, so much, you know, just easier. Um, but you can use a mouse for this um, if you want to, but I'm gonna be using my Wacom tablet. And um, I'm not just, you can, a lot of people when they do this, they just brush around the eyebrows. But if you just use your airbrush, a brush tool, you're gonna lose some of that texture on the face. So I'm gonna show you how to, how to do this, um, but maintain that texture on the face. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do, I'm, go, I'm just gonna select my um, my lasso tool here. And I'm not gonna make this like, you know, real perfect. I'm just gonna make a selection. Um, right along the top edge right here. So I'm gonna draw a line. Just like that. Okay. I'm gonna try to make that a little bit straighter. Okay, so now we got a selection. So now what you wanna do is you can use your arrow keys to move this up, move it up. And what we're gonna do now, we're gonna copy this part of the forehead. So to copy this part of the forehead, just hit Control J. Okay. Now if I have my if I hide my background there, you can see this is what we have right here. This little piece of skin. Okay. So now what you wanna do now is grab your um your move tool, use your arrow keys, and just bring it back down. See, now we have a nice sharp edge at the top of our eyebrows. Okay? And I'm gonna do the same thing at the bottom. Gonna grab my lasso tool. I'm just gonna just make a selection at the bottom. Just like that. And I'm gonna hold my um, my shift key just to make this line a little bit straighter. It's kind of my lines are not straight, but it's okay. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this selection, I'm gonna move it down. I'm gonna copy this part of the skin, hit Control J. And again, I'm gonna take my move tool and I'm gonna move this up. Now we have a sharp edge on the bottom. Okay. And what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna just put these two layers um, in their own group. So I'm gonna select both of these layers, hit Control G to make a group. So now I'm gonna show you the before and after on this side. This is before, 
This is after. Before, after, okay? So now I'm gonna go to the left side and do the same thing. I'm gonna grab my lasso tool again. And I'm gonna make a selection. Ah, let me start over. I'm gonna try to make it match the other side the best I can. Okay. And that's a little bit too much. I can, I can take some of this away by holding my Alt key. I'm just gonna take some of the other way. I don't need that much. Okay. I'm just holding my Alt key to subtract from that selection. Okay, so I'm gonna move my selection up using my arrow keys. I'm gonna hit Control J to copy this piece of the skin. Control J, up. Oh, Have to make sure your layer is selected first, okay? Control J. And I'm gonna move it back down. Do the same thing on the bottom. Get my lasso tool again. I'm gonna make another selection. There we go. I'm hit control. Now I'm gonna move my selection down. Hit control J. Take my move tool and I'm gonna move it back up. Just like that. And there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna move this up into the group as well. So I can show you guys the before and after. Okay, so that's before, that's after. Before, after. Bam, there you go, that's it people. That's how you arch your eyebrows using Adobe Photoshop. Zoom out so you can see it better. I mean, you can also go in and clean up the edges a little bit. I'm gonna just go ahead and just merge all these layers together. I'm gonna select all these layers right here. I'm gonna hit Control, Shift, E. Now you can take your spot healing brush too and just brush over this just like that. We're just, gonna, we're just smoothing out the skin just a little bit to make it look, you know, a little bit more uh, realistic. Okay. I think that'll do it. All right, so I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure you like the video. Leave a comment. If you have any questions, drop them in the comment section. Share this video with your friends and family. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. All that good stuff. Thank you guys for watching. This is Stanley Parrish, Pierce Eye Flow Studios. I'll see you later.